Hello my friends, welcome to Top Classical Music. Today we will present a short biography about Saint-Saëns. Camille Saint-Saëns was a renowned French composer, pianist, and organist, born on October 9, 1835, in Paris, France. He was a child prodigy, displaying remarkable musical talent from an early age. At just three years old, he began playing the piano, and by the age of seven, he gave his first public performance at the Salle Pleil in Paris. Saint Sands received a comprehensive education in music, studying composition, piano, and organ at the Paris Conservatoire. He quickly established himself as a virtuoso pianist and gained recognition for his exceptional abilities. As an organist, he held prominent positions at various churches in Paris, including the Church of Saint Mary and La Madeleine. Throughout his life, Saint Sands remained deeply committed to music and demonstrated exceptional versatility in his compositions. His works encompassed various genres, from symphonies and concertos to operas, chamber music, and choral pieces. He was a key figure in the Romantic period, contributing significantly to the development of French music during the 19th century. One of his most celebrated works is Danse Macabre, which beautifully combines eerie themes with captivating orchestration. Additionally, his symphonic poem Carnival of the Animals showcased his playful and imaginative side, delighting audiences with its whimsical portrayals of various animals. As a prolific composer, Saint Sands composed over 300 works, leaving a lasting impact on the classical music world. He maintained friendships with other influential composers and artists of his time, including Franz Liszt and Hector Berlioz, and became an admired mentor to future generations of musicians. Despite his immense success, Saint Sands faced some criticism for resisting the more adventurous styles of his contemporaries, such as the Impressionists. However, he remained steadfast in his adherence to classical forms and structures. Camille Saint Sands' life was marked by a love for music, a dedication to his craft, and a commitment to educating and inspiring others in the world of composition and performance. He continued to compose and perform until his final days, passing away on December 16, 1921, in Algiers, Algeria, where he had been residing for the latter part of his life. His legacy lives on through his timeless compositions, which continue to be cherished and performed by musicians and audiences worldwide. Well, that's all for today. See you in the next video.